Hello, I'm Justin Hill, prize-winning author and creator of Worlds of Words, and welcome to the 25 books that made me. And here is, I think, an exquisite little book. Um, and it's, it starts with um, a quote from Dr. Johnson's dictionary, a novel, a small tale, generally of love. And, of course, that's a perfect description of this. This, I think, is uh, the perfect miniature novel. It's a kind of novella. It's short. It's beautiful. You could almost not change a word of it. And this is J.L. Carr's A Month in the Country. I forget exactly where I came across this, um, but it's uh, it's been with me for the last 20, 25 years. And it's just exquisite. Um, it tells the story of a, um, a, a painting restorer coming to a church in North Yorkshire, uh, somewhere around here, um, after the First World War, and uh, a love story. Um, but many a, a kind of elegiac way, a novel about the end of that kind of rural England as well. Um, it's, it's short, it's beautiful, it's perfect. I, you know, I wouldn't change a word. And it also happens to be set, I mean, I, I discovered this when I was living abroad. So um, it's set in the part of the world that I've come back to live in, uh, which is not far from where I grew up, about 10 miles from where I grew up. But this part of the world is just gorgeous. It's the kind of the foothills of the North York Moors. And there. so when I was abroad listening to these, this place, describing places I knew. They, York is the big city and um, there's villages. They go out for a little trip to Sutton and the Whitestone Cliff. Uh, and so, just perfect. Absolutely brilliant novel. If you haven't read it, um, I love this. It's uh, absolutely exquisite. Again, a, a perfect miniature novel. A Month in the Country by J.L. Carr.